In previous releases, we introduced the ability to split by percentage elements of the IFC model to allow the planners to subdivide items that the 3D designers had included. Typical examples were the need to split a concrete slab modelled as one complete item into smaller parts to represent a sequence of concrete pores, or a mender wall to show it done as a number of brick lifts over time. This functionality has been strengthened through the introduction of additional splitting options. The new methods allow for items to be split based upon story or spaces that are within the model, or at intersection with other parts. Therefore, it would now be possible to split, say, a lift shaft at the points that the shaft adjoin the various floor slabs that are within the model. It's worth noting that all the splitting functions can also be set to any of the three dimensional axes, so that any one item can be split both along its length and width, but also depth. In addition to splitting items down, Asta Power Project BIM also allows for items to be merged together. Combining these features allows the user to manipulate the model to better reflect the intended build sequence.